A windy evening, falling temperatures. Meteorologist Tim McGill is back. How low will it go? Going to go pretty low tomorrow compared to what we've seen. Certainly, we've got a cold day shaping up for us on Sunday. We've got winds to deal with tonight. Those gusty winds will continue into early Sunday. The winds won't gust quite as strong, though, overnight tonight. They'll diminish to around 30, 35 mile per hour in gusts. We've been seeing gusts today up near 50 miles per hour. Wintry weather tomorrow. By that, I mean cold. Temperatures in the 40s during the afternoon, along with the winds, will feel even colder. And there's a possibility for a little bit of wet snow in areas north and northwest of the city, believe it or not. A warm up, though, next week, Monday through Thursday. By Thursday, we're back up near 70 degrees. Right now we're in the low to mid 60s. We're pretty close to average highs this time of the year. 63 at O'Hare, 62 at Midway. It's fallen a little bit in Aurora, 59, 58 degrees over in DeKalb. These temperatures anywhere from around 9 to 15 degrees warmer compared to this time yesterday. So we've warmed up for the first part of the weekend. Got a south breeze blowing around 10 to 20, near 30 miles per hour. But the gusts, they're getting up to around 50 miles per hour. Waukegan in the last hour had gusts up to 47 miles per hour. Again, those winds will diminish a little bit overnight tonight. We still have the wind advisory in effect until 7 o'clock this evening. We've got a red flag warning in effect for all these other counties from O'Hare southward all the way down into central Illinois because of extreme fire conditions. We've got some very low humidity and some very strong winds. That's in effect that red flag warning in effect until 8 o'clock this evening. So riding in that gusty west southwest wind, a couple of spotty showers here and there. There's a cold front sliding southward coming out of Minnesota. It's going to bring in that cold air tomorrow, the coldest air of the season so far. So we'll get a few spotty showers tonight. I think the better chance of rain comes during the early morning hours on Sunday. And yes, even cold enough that some of that could mix in with a few wet snowflakes. Not looking for any accumulation out of this, but you could see a few wet snowflakes flying north and west of the city. A real time satellite radar tracker shows that rain really blossoming around 3 o'clock tomorrow morning. The model earlier today was showing a little bit of snow mixing in across McHenry County towards uh, DeKalb. It's taken it out, so that's how tricky this forecast is, but still a possibility. The rain should be out of here by about 4 o'clock, and it looks like mostly cloudy skies for us on Monday. We warm up a little bit, highs back into the 50s, more rain developing probably later in the day on Monday. Tonight's low temperatures will dip down to the mid 40s, and we don't recover much from that tomorrow. Highs tomorrow only in the upper 40s. So your forecast overnight tonight, we're looking for lows tonight getting down to around oh, 43 degrees. We'll see some rain develop overnight, maybe mixing with a few wet snowflakes early tomorrow. 48 for the high tomorrow, breezy and chilly rain early. And look at those temperatures back up to near 70 degrees by Thursday next week. That's your weather. Tim, thank you.